flying around at night and you think, where are those bats going? <laughs> They're not headed to the Belfry. Believe it or not, many are headed right to your cave. Not in your sides, Liz Kotelik joins us now. You going to scare us with this? <laughs> no, don't freak out, Guy. I promise it's okay. not that scary. I mean, I guess the idea of living with these creatures may not be ideal, but I found out today it's not as bad or dangerous as you may think. They're famous for their work in caves and appearances in Halloween movies. But here's another scenario. Yes, those are bats in an attic, and when it's summer in Tucson, mama bats may make your home their home too. And actually, most people don't even know uh, that there are bats living in or on their structure. Don Carter owns Sonoran Wildlife Solutions and says he's already gone to three homes with bats this week. And that's not including the home he and his wife live in. When I watched one wiggling through the glass, I said, that's it. On the side of their house, in their chimney, they are living with bats. And until the summer's over, they're keeping it that way. A lot of these bats are it's maternity colonies. These are mothers having their little babies, and we don't want them trapped and killed. Some residents trap the bats and leave them no way to get out. Don says don't do that. The smell of dead bats lingers and you may let these loose. Bat bugs. That's usually the icing on the cake to get people not to <laughs> exclude them. His solution? They keep the bats from flying around their home by sealing their chimney from the inside. Don says once summer's over, the bats will fly away on their own. Then they'll close off the top. If you've got cool air coming up, you've got a cave in there. You know, it's just their instinct. And it's our instinct not to want to live in a bat cave, unless, of course, it looks like this. But hang out with them until the end of the summer, Don says, and it'll be your home once again. Now, it can get dangerous if a bat you're living with has rabies. So if you see a bat or its droppings anywhere inside your home, stay away from the area and call a bat specialist. All that information can be found on kgun9.com. I see them all the time just uh, eating insects in front yes. of our house. Yes, yes. <laughs> They're you. very nice. <laughs> <laughs>